good morning there folks and welcome back to the channel on this video we're off out heading to uh weedill we're off on an overnight camp i've just arrived at where uh, to pick our ian up our ian's coming along and what we're doing like i say we're off to weedill to do an overnight camp in a nice little woodland it's a woodland that i've been a few times um the last time i used it i camped there with my wife um we're heading up there and we're meeting a lad called Simon. He's doing an overnighter with us and Jamie's going to meet us later on in the day. He's, he can't camp. He's only coming up for a few hours, but he's uh, heading up there to chill with us and have a brew and what have you. So it should be good. Like I say, I've just got our ear now. I'm going to go and give him a knock on the door. Um, we'll get the car loaded and we'll head off and we'll uh, bring you along and show you the woodland where we're camping. And we're looking forward to this one. Happy days. We'll see you when we get there. Here we go, folks. We've arrived. We're at our destination. And it's absolutely stunning. Views are amazing. We'll let you have a look at them later. Like I say, we've arrived at our destination. A bit out of puff, because the hill to get up here is a bit of a killer, especially with your winter kit. Um, we tend to mainly use this woodland in the winter because it's a uh, pine woodland, coniferous, so the ground doesn't get so boggy. Um, we've had a little natter with the farmer down at the bottom. He was doing some work in the field, so I offered to shut the gate and everything for him, save him getting out of his vehicle again. A uh, little bit of a natter, so it looks like we're good for being here. Always pays to be nice. Me and Ian are gonna set up here, and what we'll do now, I'll take you along to where the lads are set up. Like I said, we're camping with Simon. Jamie's coming along later for a few hours. And Simon's friend Brendan's here. He's a canny lad. I've met him a good few times now. Well, I'll take you along to where the lads are. Look, check this woodland out. Nice and sheltered. So we'll head over here where the lads are and we'll have a look at their setup because it does look pretty good like. Uh, we'll just make our way through here. Looking stunning. It's quite dense, quite sheltered, so it's perfect location for winter camps. You'll see on one of my other videos, you'll see this wall in that, and it is Simon, a friend of mine that built it. Well, plenty of firewood there to process. There's a the lad's setups. Some firewood there made to start processing. We've got our Ian there. We've got Brendan, we've got Simon just there. Hello. We've got the lads set up just here, with Simon's there. We've got Brendan's here, he's got one of them hammocks. Check that out where you can't really see, but we'll have a look at that later, I'll put a light on. It looks absolutely cool, like. Oh, we've got the fire pit down there. All looking good. Nice reflector on it, it'll be nice and cosy round here later on tonight. Oh yeah, check that out. Some nice lights above it. Cheers, Brendan. Yeah. There we go, check that out. That is awesome, that. Absolutely fantastic. Well, what we're going to do is go and get set up ourselves. And then we can uh, get some firewood processed and get something to eat and what have you. Looking absolutely amazing. Got Ian straight into the graft, cutting firewood. There is a reason why I bring him camping. <laughs> He's got his uses. Doesn't cut on the pole. It doesn't cut on the pole. It, it only cuts on the pole. <laughs> is that one of them? Is that the silky? Oh, yes. yeah. Sulgoy. Yeah. Sulgoy, quality. See, I'm used to a pole saw. You obviously you saw it, didn't you? Yeah. I'm, I'm pulling, trying to do the cutters on the push. Silky saw. Oh, yeah, sweet. Saw. Nice, nice bit of kit. I've got the uh, samurai. samurai. The samurai. Similar sort of thing, but the samurai. And that cuts really well. Especially in comparison to the uh, back hose. It's the holding position. The holding position and the length of the blade, I yeah. think. Mint, calling. There you go, bud. There we go, there's both man and Ian's setups. We've got Ian over there, myself here, all our kit laid out underneath. 
get my stove and stuff, I'm making a brew, which we're going to do just now. So I'm uh, ready for some coffee. Ian's got the same under there, all set up. You can probably hear it's raining a little bit, but uh, not that matters. Ian taking photos. We've got the lads there set up over here. Looks like they've got the fire going already. Let me see. Is that picking that up? You keep getting there uh, a little bit of sight of the flames. So we're going to get sorted out and head over there and help them prep firewood for the rest of the day for the night. So I think it's going to be a chilly one and possibly a wet one. We are absolutely loving it already. Absolutely loving it. Oh, we're going to finish getting sorted out and get ready to get chill. Just uh, heating through a nice bit of homemade vegetable and um, gammon soup. Certainly the weather now for soup. That's just eating through nice. Just eating it up on the alcohol stove. It's smelling quite nice. A bit more pepper in I think. Just to warm you through. From the inside out. Smelling quite amazing really. Got some coffee. Very nice. Let's leave the brew inside. If I can get the lid on. There we go. Just love winter camps. You can't beat getting out. You know you're not gonna get eaten alive. You've just got to be a bit more prepared and uh, carry a little bit more cat kit. But it's well worth it. Suffer on the journey in rather than suffering when you're here. What I always say. I always leave that bubble away a little bit. Now we've got the soup bubbling away really nice. I'm ready for this, I'm absolutely starving. Give it a bit of a stir. Give it another minute, I think, and then we'll be uh, we'll get that down as. Yeah. There we go, bro. There we go, that's us with our soup. Really nice, what do you think? Absolutely disgusting, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's beautiful. Doyle. My parsnip, carrots, swede, onions, leeks. A bit of gammon, delicious, keep you nice and warm, I'll warm you up. That's it, warm is right through like. Beautiful like bro. We're going to uh, finish this off and we're going to go and head over there and give the lads a hand to get some firewood processed for the night and for cooking on later. Nice that like. Do you want any more pepper? No, that's made up bro.
Similar to that, but obviously straight. Straight. Yeah, and it's got a straight handle on it. Oh, that marries in with the end of the. Uh, it's a good idea, that like, isn't it? Yeah. Just for good idea. Just for trimming any trimming. things. Pruning so. Yeah. yeah. That's going that way. That's three in the same spot and put powder. That's it. That's hard. Come cut one of these again. Yeah, the Fleming firewood's done. Lower that down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that is like a knife through butter. No, I've just come out the woodland, thought I'd have a little mooch about and I'm just uh, having a little look along there onto the hills, the sun's starting to set, the sky's looking amazing and as you can see uh, that the mist and the cloud that was low onto the hills is now cleared but it looks as though we're getting a little bit more coming over, that sky's looking fantastic, it's chilled right down now. Uh, so it feels as though it could have a bit of a frost, but I think of the way that cloud's coming over, um, we'll probably get the rain. We are forecasted, but it's looking absolutely spectacular. It's a stunning place, this. And clouds. Bring that camera down a touch. That's looking fantastic. A little bit chilly. I'm gonna head back into the woodland now. I'm gonna say we've got, I don't know, maybe it's an hour daylight or something like that. But uh, in the woodland, it is already starting to get dark. So we'll head back in there now. Just when we were over there. As you, you can that? see, it's dark now. We've got Jamie's yeah. joined us. Hello, Jamie. I, I was going to say hello, Jamie. <laughs> hello, Jamie. Hello, Jamie. Hi, Jamie. You'll have to excuse him. This later. You'll have to excuse him. He's from Sunderland. Jesus, <laughs> Jesus, Ian chilling by the fire. Hello, Simon's just shot a load more wood on the fire. Brendan's just here. And right. we're just all having a happy time. It's absolutely quality. We're all absolutely loving it. And we're just chilling. Enjoying the fire. It's lovely and warm. We're going to get sorted out and get some scrambling. Happy days. I brought for heaters. <laughs> <laughs> you brought for heaters? Yeah. I cooked it the other time I was there. Loved it. Jamie's going to be doing Thank the walk of shame me. because he's not staying no, the night. No. So we'll get that. We'll make sure we get that on uh, yeah. camera. Make, remind me, lads, so we don't forget. We'll follow him all the way. We'll down follow him down to the. We'll have follow him down there. No, no, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Peter's just, uh, Peter, Flim and Jimmy's just been getting a tattoo. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Looking yeah. cool. Looking smart, that's that, Jimmy. It's just there. Uh, peeling a little bit up a minute now. Oh, my granddad's initials on. Mind? Yeah. Spot on, bud. But yeah, we're having a great time. Surprisingly, yeah. Fire's nice. Yeah, no. What more what do you want?
Do you still find fireflies? Doesn't it just? I'll move it further away. Good class out. Epic. Can you like it? <laughs> You're not getting see. Uh, he's blinding us. <laughs> Poor Jamie's got to do the walk of shame. I have. Jamie's going home. Unlucky lad. I have. And we're all staying. <laughs> <That's> all right. <laughs> all right. Bye, Jamie. I'm there. I'll send you the pictures later. God, this is like being on I'm a Celebrity, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Jamie. Bye. Bye, Jamie. Bye, 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 where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? I was going to have a couple over there. Nah, you're going, nah. you're going home. No, it's like the bush stuck, a trial walk, isn't it? Yeah. The no, walk of shame. See you later, Jamie. You later. Now go home. Bye. See you later, bud. See you later. Give us three rings when you get in. Have a nice day at work tomorrow, mate. Have fun. Bye. Good morning, folks. Last night was absolutely fantastic. We had some good food. We had a good laugh. Chilling by the fire and that. It was absolutely brilliant. Um, it was funny when Jamie had to go and do the walk of shame because we absolutely ripped him for that. Uh, had a good night's sleep. It was really warm in my hammock. Really toasty. Um, the rain woke us up a few times because we've had quite a bit of heavy rain through the night. But uh, overall stayed really warm, which was nice, because it was quite chilly last night. But yeah, we've had a fair bit of rain. Uh, but when you're under the taps and stuff like that, it doesn't matter so much. Fire roaring away. Uh, good company, a few beers, a good laugh. And what more do you need? Well, we'll go out onto the uh, out to the woodland now, and we'll have a look, because it's uh, not looking so good. Weather wise, like, but we'll have a pop round there now. Cloud lying low on top of the hills over there. Another woodland over there in the distance, might be worth uh, having a check of that sometime. There we go, okay. Might be worth looking at that one up on the hilltop there. Oh, a bit quick there. I'm looking a bit naff weather wise over that way. Still looks quite stunning like. Beautiful. There we go, that's us all packed up, ready to go. Unfortunately, we've got a rush off this morning. We've got Ian's kit there, my kit just over there. I've got my sleeping bag just here, hanging on a tree. But that's where I was set up, and Ian just here. And as always, leave no trace. Obviously, you can see where we've been walking around, but that can't be helped, we can't do nothing about that. The lads are over there packing up as well. We'll head over there and we'll say our goodbyes to them. We've got the lads there packing up as well. Ian stood where the fire was. Watching. Watching. <laughs> and the lads putting all their kit away. Spectator's spot. <laughs> Spectator's spot. The, uh, it's been a good, good night, lads, hasn't it? Really, it has. really it's been cracking, really enjoyed it. Yep. Poor Jamie. Poor Jamie, you missed a treat st staying here, not staying here last night, mate. We had a great laugh. Camera, you don't have to Mostly at your expense when you had to go, mate. I'll just keep on standing over here. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's been good. <laughs> no, exactly well, the lads are keeping it nice and tidy, which is what it's all about. We'll uh, leave them to it. Right, folks, that's us now. He's lasering, yeah. <laughs> yes, I can see. <laughs> We're uh, heading home, unfortunately, I'm gutted, because it's been good, it'd be nice to spend a bit more time here. We've had to skip breakfast today to get packed up, 
Um, but yeah, it's been a really good camp. Thoroughly enjoyed it, and we'll definitely be camping with Simon and Brendan again. Uh, how have you enjoyed it, bro? Absolutely brilliant. You pulling face things behind my head. But yeah, it's been good. Um, if you've enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. And as always, stay safe and we'll see you on the next one. Bye for now, folks.